guys and gals, yo, what'd you think of that last episode of Escape Sierra Leone? We did find some points of interest, and I think what I really need to do, I need to somehow, let's see, did I drink this already? I need to figure out how to make these little flag markers. Uh, I need to turn this light off, that's not it. Um... Because I think if I make the flag markers, I could put them down so I can find my locations better. I, I don't know if that's what they do or not. It just makes sense that that would be what they do. So if I can do that, that would be totally freaking awesome. What time is it? It's 427. Yes, I had to sleep in order to get back here because it was so dark. I couldn't see where the heck I was going. So yeah, that's a thing, guys. The sleeping. Oh, so that's empty. So that's about useless. And we'll put that back on the table. Well, fooey patooey. I don't think this one has anything in it either. We did drop the other one, right? Where is it? Oh. Really, I dropped it way over there behind the chair. That's kind of funny. I guess you just need to point where you want to drop something. That way you're not just dropping it anywhere. I think I drank this one too. Yeah, they're both empty. Oh, goody. Oh, goody. I don't know where I'm supposed to get more food. I really don't have a clue about that. Because I don't have anything else here, I don't think. Pretty sure I drank the soda, too. Let's see. Soda, are you empty? You are empty. That's what I thought. And I don't think that we have any food because I'm pretty sure this needs to be cooked and I don't know how to cook that raw meat okay all right you should really cook this before eating it to make it safe to eat and improve nutritional value it can be eaten as is but do so at your own risk so oh is it getting dark already I don't want to have you guys here for a dark episode, you know, a, a nighttime episode. But look, our mental state's back to good anyway. So yeah, I don't want to use that either, unless I can actually cook it on the fire. Because I do have a fire out there, but I don't think you can... I think you have to make something to cook that on. Wow, I can't believe it's getting dark already. It was only three something. All right, let's look at this workbench. Molotov, water catcher, create marker flag. See, I feel like it should tell you what they do, though. I guess once you actually make one, it will tell you what you can do with it. So it says this is dirty. I don't have any rags. So I can't clean it. I don't think. Yeah, I have zero rags. Oh, well, my weapon is dirty. Whatever are we going to do? Um, so, yeah, I may have to pause the video until the night goes through, guys, because you're not going to be able to see anything. Because it's already getting dark outside. It's getting super dark. Anything up there? I don't think so. Got that. We're going to have to find out where our boat is. Um, I don't have any more food here either. I don't have any food. I don't have any anything to drink. We left our door open. Somebody could just come in and slaughter us if they wanted. I do wonder though if I light this, if I can bring food out here. Can't I light this? I should be able to light this. Hello? Please allow me to light this thing. So I have matches. Why won't it let me light it? Hello? Hello? Yeah, it's not going to let me light it. Well, that's totally not cool. Because I think you just hit use and it will light it for you. So, Because I lit the other one. Oh, I know what I got to do. Wait a minute. I just have to go in here and hit use that. And it will light it for me. Now, can I cook the meat there? Uh, inventory close. 
If I walk up to it, can I cook the meat on there? Uh, no. I don't want to hit use on the meat and then have, you know, get some sort of poisoning for that use. Um, so I'm at the fireplace. Would it actually let me use it? Can I drop it in there? I should really cook this before eating to make it safe to eat and improve nutritional value. Okay, so I'm over a fireplace. Does that mean if I'm over the fireplace, I'll be able to cook that? These are all things I need to look up, I guess, and figure out. But yeah, I guess what I'm going to do is I will pause the video, because I don't want to keep you guys overnight. That would just be a horrible idea. But sadly, I don't have any resources to actually... Um, did I turn this light off? Oh, let's turn that off. Let's not waste our electricity. Or waste our battery. Alright, so yeah, I will bring you guys back bring you guys back in a few minutes. Hello, house. Where are you? Oh, you're right here. I just can't see to get up the stars. So yeah, if I can't see, you guys can't see, right? Ha ha ha. Anyway. Alright guys, yep. I'll bring you back here in just a few minutes once the uh, nightfall has left us. That will be the plan. I'm going to light this lantern too while I'm in here as well. Alright guys, catch you in a few minutes. Alright guys and gals, welcome back. So yeah, it's daytime now mostly. It's still kind of hard to see though because it's very early in the day and I'm going the wrong way. The door is over here. Alright, so, I don't know. My guy might die of starvation or something, or whatever. Thirst. Because, yeah. Alright, we're going to try and go back to that camp, or that area that we just raided, and see if there was anything to eat or drink there. If I can remember how I went over there. I don't really know that I actually remember how I went over there. That's why I feel like I need to make those flag markers, because I think the flag markers, you put them up, and that helps you to know where, you, where you've been. I didn't go this way to get there. I went the other way, but we're going to go around this way to get back over there, because you can't get there this way. Pretty sure. So we're going to go that way, and you can go over this way and see what was over there look around there more now that it's freaking daylight outside and you can see. So we'll go check that out. What is this? Just a rock or something? It looks like it's just a rock. But yeah, he might pass out or something again. Because remember last night when we were crossing the bridge, he passed out or something? But he got back up. I thought that was the end. I'm like, what the hell? Like, what does that mean? So yeah, we'll go back around here. I don't know, see what's over here. See if I can get him at least something to drink over there. I think there was things to drink over here. And pick up another weapon. That's the plan. But yeah, I came back over here this way. So we should be good to go this way. Hopefully no one has spawned in here somewhere. That would not be super good at all. Yes, it should be around here. Or actually, it's on that end over there, I guess. In that direction that I'm looking. Over there somewhere. Is where that freaking thing was that we attacked. That place, that little camp of theirs. We killed both guys there. That was cool. I don't know what I'm supposed to do for water and stuff. Because I don't know how... I can't make the water catcher. i got to find my boat. I kind of know where it is, but I kind of don't. You know what I'm saying? Sort of know. I sort of don't know. We might just end up walking around this entire island to make our way back to the boat. Because I was pretty sure the boat was on this island. I don't recall swimming over here. 
I recall bringing a boat over here. Now, hopefully they haven't remanned this freaking post that we took out over here. We shall find out, I suppose. I don't think they are remanned once you take over them. But these are all things we are learning, so we shall soon find out if, in fact, they did come back over here. I know, dude, I'm running you to death, but you know what? We must go back over here and get our stuff. So I know they had drinks, but I don't think they had any food over here. I think that's going to be the only issue. Because there was no freaking food at this camp. There wasn't any. Now see, if we look at the map... Oh, see, there's a tower over there. Isn't that a tower? That's not the tower we were at, though, because we didn't do any swimming to get there. Oh no, we went over the bridge to get there. But I don't think that's our tower. We might have to be careful here. But yeah, if we look at the map... Let's look at this map. That area looks like... Oh, I can't even show it to you on here. Mess... Mess Mehek? I don't know how to pronounce these names. It looks like that island. The one that we're looking at across from here. So I think we're on Ricketts Island. I think we are on the Ricketts Island. I don't know though. As I was just saying, that one, that island that's at the very, at the left, the bottom left corner there, that island has the stone all around it. Like this one that we're looking at right here. So I think we're on the Rickett Island. I don't know how, that's how you say it or not. But that's how I'm going to say it. Yeah, I am. But there's a tower there, so I don't know. It seems like this could be all wrong. But yeah, running back in the dark, that was super fun last night. Not really. But yes, there's a tower over there, people. A tower. But at least we're getting all the way around this base, so that's totally cool. I mean, this island. I'm pretty sure we've been almost all the way around it. But this was the island that the... Uh, that group was on. I don't know why I haven't found that freaking base yet. I thought I walked completely around this island. Maybe I have not. Maybe that's the island we started on over there. I feel like maybe that is the island we started on. I, I don't know. I could be wrong. Uh-oh, you hear his belly? Yeah, that's the island we started on. So we're on this Rickett, Rickett's Island. Let's go back here. There was some stuff back here, darn it. Let's go around the rocks. I don't know if there was anything to drink though. There was stuff back here. I mean, I know there was a gas can back here. But he's probably going to starve. I guess that's a thing in this game. Maybe. I don't know. I haven't experienced that yet, so I'm not 100% sure. But there was stuff around these rocks, I thought. Yeah. Just the gas thing. Darn it. Well, phooey. So that means we're about to encounter these guys again. But I really don't want to do that because I don't have the ammo to deal with these freaking fools. But that also means our boat is over here. So yeah, I believe we are on the really big island. Because that's the island we came from now that I think about it. And then our little boathouse should be right around here. Yeah, so I'm pretty sure we're on Ricketts Island. Could be sure. I'm hoping we have some water or something over at this little boathouse. I don't remember if we did or not, though. See, there's our little boathouse. And then in that next cove over there is the bad guys. The 
super duper bad guys are over there. Yeah, I don't know how we get to the uh, to that little that little place over there that we just came from through here. Cuz I don't remember seeing a trail over here. Hopefully no one's come over here and taken this over or anything. That would be super not cool. Hopefully there's some freaking food in here. I thought I saw something in there. There's not a guy in there, is it? There better not be. Not allowed in there. I took over that place. I think it's just our boat. Hello, boat. And there's our sleeping bag. Maybe we'll save. Well, I don't know if we want to save right here. But right, that's gas can. Yeah, so there's stuff over there, but I really don't think. I don't think we have anything to eat or drink over here. Well, fooey patooey, guys. Darn it. Dagnabbit. I kind of want to take these things. Um, I don't know if we have enough gas to get around back to the other side. Yo, boat. What are you doing? You're so loud. Oh, it was this thing. The buoy fell over. Where did our freaking sleeping bag go? Oh, there it is. I don't want to use that, though. Why can't we use it? Like, pick it up and use it. Alright, so we're going to get in here. Alright, how are you starting to move? We're going to go back around the island. I don't know if we're going to get very far. <laughs> Oh my gosh, I hope so. We're going to go back this way that we just came from. I don't want to go driving past them. Because I don't know if that will provoke them to attack us. But if we can go around this way to get back to uh, um, that base that we attacked last night, that would be super cool. So that's what we're going to try and do. Because I think I would have food and stuff there. Try and get back over there. And since that was on the water, we should be able to dock this there. And there's gas there. If we can make it, oh my gosh. I don't know because that's so far away. It's super far away. It's super bad. I mean, if I have to, I'll just get out of this silly thing when it runs out of gas. Hopefully we don't have to do that. Hopefully we make it around the island. You know, I could have swore I walked around this side the other you know, the other day when we were playing, but I did not see the boathouse. Unless I just didn't walk far enough around. Hopefully we don't get shot at going through here. But that's the island we started on, so we're on the Ricketts Island. We're on the biggest island, so that's cool. Don't beach the boat, girl there. That would be super bad. I mean, we can get faster by hitting shift, but I'm trying not to lose all the gas, so I don't want to use it up really quickly. Take our boat over to the other side. I wish we could have brought the sleeping bag. I'm going to have to run back to that camp in order to, you know, save my game. There's got to be a way to carry the sleeping bag. I don't think you can, though. I think it's just a safe point. I don't know, though. I don't know. So we walked past those rocks. So we need to just keep going. We're still decent on gas. It's not on empty. So I think we'll make it around there. I'm just hoping we make it to the area that uh, we attacked last night. We can park it there, and I think he can get some food and water over there. Well, I don't know if there's any food. I know there was water over there for him to drink. But I have a bad feeling about this guy not making it. I'm really 
tempted to just get around here and then run back up there and save. That way if I die, it's fine. I'm very, very tempted to do that. I wish there was a sleeping bag around the uh, in that camp we found last night, but there's not, so I don't know what we're supposed to do. Okay, so there's our path. I don't know if y'all see that over there, but the path is right there to our place. So I'm really tempted to park the boat next to that and go grab the rest of the gas and save. Oh, but if I save, I sleep though. That's kind of annoying. Why does it do that? Alright, whatever. Let's just try to make it back over to this freaking last night because there is gas there and we have gas in that house over there so I want to hit shift so we can go faster but Alright, 
turn the boat around. Turn it. Nope. Don't go that way. Back up. We're going to try and pull up to the ladder here. Nope. Back up. Back up. I'm surprised he's not freaking complaining about being super hungry. Back up, boat. Alright, we should be able to pull right up to here and hopefully use the ladder to get off, right? Right? If I look at the ladder? No? Um, hello? Can I use the ladder? Alright, I should be able to use this ladder, I think. Am I close enough to the ladder? What? Oh, I dropped my gun. That is so dumb. You should not drop your weapon. Ugh. I thought because I was going directly to the ladder, I would not drop it. Oh, no, my boat flipped over. What the hell? Well, that's totally not cool. Why'd my freaking boat flip over? Can we get down without getting hurt? Well, that sucks butt just a little bit. Can we flip the boat back over? Wow, what the hell is up with that? Why would the boat flip over? I know the boat flipped over, really? Tell me something <coughs> I don't know. Oh, okay, let's get you a drink. I think there's a drink in here. Buddy. There wasn't there. Is there not a drink in here? Did we already drink it all? Oh, here, we can eat these. Let's eat those. That'll give us some hydration. Inventory. All right, open those and drink them, please. Yeah, I know you're freaking thirsty, bro beans. Now we lost our weapon. It's in the water. How am I supposed to pick it up when it's in the freaking water? Can anyone explain that to me? If you can't carry it in the water, how can you pick it up from the water? Because you're going to be in the water when you pick it up. So, don't totally understand that at all. But, yeah. Alright, so he's got that. Alright, is there anything else here you can eat or drink? I don't think there is. Alright, we still have our shotgun, I guess. But, how am I supposed to get something to drink? This looks like dirty water. Pretty sure it's dirty. Dirty water. Yep, we don't want to drink dirty water. So I don't know. This poor guy might uh, die of dehydration. Uh, what is that? Can we look at that, please? Oh, we got that. Um, is there anything to drink over here? Maybe someone left to drink over here now? No, what about in the tower? see if there is anything to drink up here. I don't recall. I don't understand how we do that, though. I guess because it was a weapon I dropped it. That was, like, my best weapon. So, that kind of sucked dropping that, to be honest with you. And this guy just had an empty canteen up here. Guy we killed up here. Your backpack is full. Oh, that's awesome. So, what can we drop? Like, freaking nothing? I don't really want to drop this stuff. I need this stuff to make other things. I guess we'll just drop this because I don't freaking have... I don't have that weapon now. I just freaking dropped it in the water. Because every time you go in the water, you drop your weapon. Yeah, they really need to work on that. Just saying. You did pick up the pistol, right, fool? Alright, because I think this ammo that I have here is for the pistol, so use, refill. So this does not use that? It does use that. Okay, so why can't I use that? Alright, use that please. Now maybe I can use it, yeah? Refill. Oh, well, no, that's not what I wanted to do. 
What is this? That's not the right thing. All right, so let's see. Inventory. I think if I just hit R, he will reload that into his weapon. And then he should have five rounds. Right, fool? You got five rounds now? Or whatever? I guess not because that had... All right, so inventory. Swap that out. Inventory. Why does he only have four rounds in there? There's no way this pistol only holds four rounds. That can't be right. Or does he have to reload each individual one like that? That's crazy if that's how he has to do that. Oh no, it just removed that. What did it do? Maybe there are two different ammo or something. Because one has three rounds and one has four rounds. Oh, I am totally confused. Totally. All right, refill. We'll take the one that has four rounds. All right, inventory. Let's swap these out. All right, so I just want to see what it says when I reload it. All right, reload, and then we're going to swap it again. And see how many rounds it has in it. Inventory and click the swap. Yeah, they must be completely different. I don't understand what's going on here. Because it should just be five rounds. Okay, whatever. Doesn't matter. Doesn't matter, man. Doesn't matter. Alright, guys. So not the most interesting episode. I'm going to try and get back uh, I don't know if I want to go back to that house, though. Because there's, like, no food or water there, either. But I need to save. Oh, if I use the ladder with this in my hand, I'm going to drop it. So, you can hold the flashlight when you go down the ladder, but you can't use the, the weapon. Because you will drop it. Well, that's certainly not cool. So anyway, I am going to go save, guys, but I'm not going to keep you here for that because you're not going to be able to see anything. So I am going to make my way back over there unless he dies on the way over there because he's, like, totally dehydrated. Um, I guess I could drink the dirty water and see what happens. I'm going to drink the dirty water. Maybe it'll kill me instantly or something. I know it says that it's not good for you. That is not good for you. This is, uh, dirty. Alright, this bottle is filled with dirty, unpurified water. It provides a large amount of H2O at risk of contracting waterborne illness. This item is refillable. So what will this do? Used to treat serious infections and illness. So, okay, we can drink this. And I guess if you get sick, then... I guess there's just a percent chance that he's going to get sick because this sickness meter isn't coming up. Alright, so let's drop that. And if for some reason he starts getting ill, I will. I guess it messed with his mental state though. I feel like that just dropped. But yeah, we can take the pills for his mental state. I, I mean, for that, supposedly. Alright guys, so I'm going to end the episode here because it is late. I'm going to go save. That way if I were to die, whatever, it would be okay. It wouldn't be a big deal. So until next time, guys, I will catch you later. Bye!